Okay, so viewers, you are once again welcome to our keyboard and strings training or class. Now, today we are going to learn something small about a very powerful worship intro that will put everybody on in the church or wherever you find yourself as soon as you play it. Yeah, and um, I'm going to teach you very fast on the keyboard. Now, um, let's move on. So this is how it goes. Now, so let, let's let's learn it right now. Now, um, it starts from La. I'm teaching this on key F. I'm teaching this on key F. Uh -huh. So the progression starts from La. So the bass side will be like La Ti Do. It is the same as La So Do So La Ti Do. Right? So let's go. Now this is how it is. So you see, let, look at the bass side. Just look on at the bass side. how it is now we are playing la so do or la ti do on the bass and when you come here on the right side you are playing re and the third chord for re that is la re fa la re fa right this one then you bring your like small finger so so it will be like this so when you play the la on the bass side, now this is how it's going to be. The, 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 the re, you play the re on the right side, that is la, re, fa on the right side, then the la on the left side. So the re for the la. Then when you're moving to T, your small hand goes to so, this hand, it goes to so, so it will be like this. It's be like this. You see? Then you come to do. But instead of you playing do, you use this finger to play the tall. You see? So it becomes like this. You see how it is? You see how it is? Okay. So let's go over once more. This is how it is. You see how it is? So let's go over once more. So la, then the ray on the la, then your small finger on the so, like this. You see? Still, this, your, your hands will still be on the ray when you are moving to T, so when you are on the La, you're, you play Re on the La, then your hands will still be on the Re when you are moving to T, but your small hand, your small finger will just move to the So, so like this. Then you, you play Do, but instead of playing Do, you play To, huh? yeah, yeah, Do plus To, so it will be like this. So it will be So, To, Do, Mi, So, To, Do, Mi, so to do and me. So it will be like this. You see how it is. Then the second on the second phase, we play like this. Fa, we are coming, we are coming to play. Fa la re. Fa la re. Easy. Fa la re. Now, on the fa, fa la re on the left side, that is fa la re. That is on the second one. So we are going to play like this. Fa to you play re, second re for fa. That is fa la re. So it will be like this. Right? 
Then for the la, okay, it's on the fa, it's fa, la, re. Okay, then moving to the la, look at this chord very well. Me, most people don't know it, but it is a very sweet chord that is being used most often in powerful strings or playing powerful strings. Yeah, it will help you and it will make your strings very, very powerful. Now look at this chord. La on this. Do, la, re, and mi. Do, la, re, mi, right? Do, la, re, and mi. So it's like this. You see how it sounds? You see, so it's like this. Fa. Then you play this chord. Do, do, la, re, and mi, right? Then we come back to the the re, right? Right? You come back to the, the second re. After that, then you go here. T. Right? That is this is the third, this is the third phase of the strings that we are learning. So it has three phases. So this is the third phase of the strings that we are learning. You see how it is? T. to this the re fa la re uh. then la re for the lie this time around you we won't play any um chord for it so it's like la re fa la re then you end then you end <laughs> 